Hey everybody, hope you guys enjoyed that live um, cooking that I did. Here is the food now. We're going to indulge. But before I do that, we have to pray, man. We have to pray for this food. Dear Father in heaven, thank you for the collard greens, the Alfredo, and the chicken and the yams. Amen. Amen. All right, so and of course I have my, some good old a country iced tea. Don't play with me, okay? And they don't play with me when it comes to the iced tea. That needs to be my theme song. Don't play with me when it comes to the iced tea. Hey, don't play with me when it comes to the iced tea. All right, so I got to have my little napkins here. Uh-huh. Yes, now it is time to dig in. Now, do I need a fork? Do I need a knife? I think I'll bring on this little knife here and cut up my little chicken. This is sesame chicken, by the way, guys. Sorry about that. Turn this around so y'all can see. Yeah. Okay. Is everything good? Okay, yeah. This is actually sesame chicken. Damn. Mmm. Oh my God, it turned out delicious. Mmm. It turned out really, really good. Let's try the yams. Mm-hmm. As you can see, the yams are still piping hot. You know, that's how y'all like it. <laughs> piping hot. Oh, piping hot. Mm. Baby, you know, when you're digging that tooth like that, okay, Oh my God. Oh. Mmm. These collard greens are so good. Mm. Now, don't be mad at me, okay? I didn't add any salt to the collard greens because I don't want to, you know, I don't like a lot of salt. But don't be mad at me. I'm just going to just put a little tad, okay? Don't be hollering and screaming to the thing. Ooh, PT, you put all that salt on now. You don't get high blood pressure. Go to hell. <laughs> yeah, just, just a little tad. That's all. That's better, child. <laughs> this is a... Mm. The Alfredo. Dig into this chicken again. Sesame chicken. You like a sesame chicken? You like a sesame chicken? We have a sesame chicken for you. Iced tea is perfect. You know we have, you know we have the best iced tea. I hate to say it, McDonald's, huh. baby. You go to McDonald's, say, hey baby, give me half and half, half sweet, half unsweet. I'm telling you, that is the best damn chicken. I mean, huh. the best damn tea. You have to get unsweet because it's too sweet. If you get the sweet, it's too, too sweet. You have to get the unsweet tea because it's, that's, that stuff is just, ugh. And there's nothing wrong with a little cinnamon on your yams. I had already put some cinnamon on there. I would like to put a little bit more, but I don't see it, so I ain't gonna worry about it. Mm. I mean, this sesame chicken is the tea. 
Mmm. And McDonald's has the best iced tea and it'd be just perfect. Oh my God. Especially you put enough ice in there to be chilled. Ooh, Lord. Most of the time, believe it or not, I drink unsweet tea. Because y'all know all this sugar ain't good for you. Especially the gays, honey. Y'all got too much sugar in y'all <laughs> already. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my God. Mm. Oh, sent from heaven. I used to play my whole life. Sent from heaven. Mm -hmm. mm. The sesame ch chicken do taste like the stuff they be at the Chinese store. Will you get the sesame chicken? Yeah, so let me try. Good. And I've been told that sesame is good for you. Ginger, ginger and sesame. And ginger is good for you, ginger. And these yams could use a little bit more sugar, but I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to stay away from all this sugar. Somebody said earlier, oh, you need some toast and some bread. No, I don't. Y'all just trying to make me fat. And don't want me to lose this weight. This is absolutely delicious. I'm glad you guys joined me for dinner. Mmm. 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 I can get enough of this chicken, and the chicken is cooked to perfection, honey. You gotta make sure that chicken is cooked all the way through, honey. Because, honey, you get home, get before you know it, you be in your bed. Running around like a chicken, we done got something you don't want. You heard me? Shout out to all the people in New Orleans, Louisiana, that's watching. Happy Mardi Gras. I know you spent time I stayed in New Orleans for Mardi Gras. Thank you, Jesus, for covering me in the blood. Because, baby, I was running them streets. Ooh. It can be, no, New Orleans can be a dangerous area, any but it can be dangerous. But, New Orleans can be a dangerous place. If you're in the wrong, pl in the wrong place, folks get shot, people go down there for Mardi Gras and don't never come home. So, and I'm always afraid. To be in a crowd of people and somebody have a a weapon on them and they start shooting at me, it's like, you know, I just don't, I don't like crowds. When I used to go to New Orleans, people like to, they just like to go up on, they go down on Bourbon Street and they just like being in all them crowds. You know, what if somebody starts shooting? And you know what's sad? Y'all can be mad all y'all want. I'm going to say it. Most of the time, you know who be starting mess down there? Them little badass kids. And they be what color? I'm sorry. I had to say it. Well, y'all, I'm about to end this mukbang, this sesame chicken mukbang part two. It's been real. I 
do not want to stuff myself, but it's been real. It's been fun. I love you all. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment. And if you like the show, please, the Cash App and the PayPal button is below. Appreciate you. Thank you.